Apple has recently released iOS 18.3 Beta 3 to developers, signaling that this update could be one of the last before the official release of iOS 18.3 later this month. The update comes with several noteworthy changes that aim to improve user experience, performance, and clarity. If you're a developer testing the latest beta, here's a detailed yet accessible overview of what's new in this upcoming release. Apple has made noticeable updates to the controversial notification summary feature. For those unfamiliar, this feature attempts to group notifications into summaries to provide a quick snapshot of what's happening. In this new beta, notification summaries now appear in italicized text, helping users clearly differentiate between standard notifications and AI-generated summaries. Furthermore, news, Reddit, and TV notifications are temporarily unavailable in this update while Apple refines the feature. Once it is improved, these summaries will be restored, making the overall experience more reliable. Users can now thumbs up or thumbs down summarize notifications that they feel are misleading. This feature makes it easier for Apple to improve the accuracy of its summaries. There's also a key change in the camera feature. The auto exposure autofocus lock function, which allows users to lock the focus and exposure of their camera with a light press and hold, now offers a more controlled and DSLR-like shooting experience. With the new update, when cropping a PDF document, the system now offers a warning that cropped content may not be visible to most PDF viewers. The warning provides clarity, so users won't mistakenly believe the content has disappeared altogether. iOS 18.3 Beta 3 introduces a useful tweak for the calculator app. Users can now repeat previous calculations by simply pressing the equals button multiple times. This adjustment saves time when performing repetitive math, adding a layer of efficiency to everyday tasks. If you own a smart vacuum, you can now control it from the home app, alongside your other smart devices, whether it's setting schedules or monitoring its cleaning status. While Apple Intelligence, the company's AI-driven features, including Siri, hasn't seen major changes in this release, there are significant hints at upcoming enhancements in future updates. As expected with any beta update, some users have noted slightly lower Geekbench scores compared to previous versions. However, these scores are expected to stabilize once the device finishes indexing after the update. Battery life seems to be fairly stable with this version, with no major issues reported. You can likely expect smoother performance and no significant overheating problems. In summary, iOS 18.3 Beta 3 is a solid update. Apple has taken feedback seriously by addressing past issues with news summaries and adding useful features like feedback options, allowing users to influence future improvements. A stable public release is expected by the end of January 2025. With iOS 18.4 already on the horizon, it's clear that Apple is focusing on refining its device ecosystem to make it smarter, more efficient, and user-friendly. So that's all for today, if you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and we'll see you in the next one, goodbye.